Well, getting into metals and tool tip. So uh, if you've ever tried to, especially in welding, if you've ever got holes that have been drilled in sheet metal, uh, or maybe you need to weld two panels together and there's holes in them, and you need to fill those holes in, well, when you take a welder and you feed it through a hole, you really don't get any contact and uh, nothing's going to stick. So using a, what they call a copper spoon, uh, which you can literally use a copper spoon if you want to, or you can buy these at, you know, at the hardware stores or at a welding store or what have you. I thought you were going to say Walmart, <laughs> but go ahead. Yeah, well, maybe you can buy copper spoons at Walmart. Um, but basically, you literally, you just use this spoon as a backer or, or just a, you know, a piece of copper, and the, the weld puddle will not stick to the copper. And so basically what you'll have is where you can actually fill in the metal with that copper spoon back there and then just pull it away. So it works really, really neat, really, really great, and it's and simple to do. And you can even take something like a copper plumbing fitting and just flatten it out. So take like a, you know, just a, a, you know, a sweat joint or a, a, um, a collar mm -hmm. and flatten it out and use that as a backer and maybe just, you know, weld a little piece onto it to use for a handle. Um, but yeah, you can use that for behind, the, for, for behind the hole, fill the hole in with your MIG, MIG welder and move on. And now you've filled that hole with metal and uh, you can use it over and over.